Today, new generations of workers use their phone and pictures as a primary way to communicate with their team. So we want to make that process a little bit simpler by adding some AI into the mix. Right on my phone, I can use Office to take a picture of this data that I want to share with my team. Now, Office will be able to con intelligently convert this data into a real table in Excel automatically. I don't have to go through the process of manually entering line item by line item. It's all going to happen for me using AI. Now, now that this is something I can insert into Excel, I can start to work with it right here on my phone, or I can work with it on my laptop. Now that it's in Excel, I can start to co-edit and co-author with my team. I can format it as a table, manipulate this data, sort, and work with it in ways I just couldn't do with a static image. Now, this intelligence is also powering new experiences in PowerPoint with Presenter Coach, which gives me valuable insights as I rehearse my presentation, like this one, helping me show up more prepared every single time. Let's check it out. So I'm going to say Rehearse with Coach. Now, before we get started here, what's going to happen is that as I rehearse my presentation, it's going to give me real-time feedback on all the different ways that I can improve, whether it's language choice or pacing. Let's see what that works, looks like. It is so great to be here with you guys and be able to share this presentation. Um, I mean, you know, we've had a really, really great year, and I think there's some incredible research that we can share to really kickstart FY20. Um, and yeah. You know, we had an incredible year, surpassing 500 million in revenue for the first time as a result of our team's focus on customer success and commitment to deliver quality. All right, let's finish there. Now, you may have noticed that it was giving me that feedback in real time that's also been summarized in this report here. It picked up that I said you guys, which isn't super gender inclusive language, and recommended that I say you all instead. It caught some of my filler words like um and I mean, and even let me know my pace was a little bit too fast, a great reminder to slow down. It even recognized when I was too dependent on the slide content itself, reading word for word, and even let me know exactly which slide I should probably familiarize myself with a little bit more. Pretty cool, right? But how do we bring this same intelligence into the thing we most often do at work, meetings? Most of us here collaborate in mixed scenarios, where some of us are in a meeting room and some of us are dialing in remotely. The challenge with these types of meetings is that when the people in the room get up to do something like brainstorm on a physical whiteboard, the team online can't really see what's going on or engage with the content, and it's hard to feel included. Microsoft Teams wants to ensure everyone is equally engaged in the brainstorming process. Let's check out how. This Microsoft Teams room has a dedicated whiteboard camera that we can connect. Using AI, the camera will be able to find the whiteboard image and pull it into focus for the team online, helping them engage with the content. It also detects people and makes them transparent. So as I walk in front of the whiteboard to write something, the team online will be able to see the content right through me. Like, literally right through me. <laughs> 